Today we'll be working on our main harness. Welcome to page 31. So, you can see I cleaned up a lot of the floor here. I got something like 20 raw wires coming off the side here that need to be tied to something. I looped up all this stuff just to kind of clean it up, get it out of the way. Try to organize so it's not on top of each other, that it's routing the, you know, the right way to not get in and around. And 
believe me, these raw wires, man, I had to keep pulling through and then I'd do something else and I'd have to pull them through again and do something. <laughs> it's just like crazy. And I don't know if you can see my face in these videos, but I am one not happy camper. This is not, uh, this is not fun. So, and you know, I don't mind wiring, but I really don't like putting random different harnesses together to try to create something. It's kind of annoying. And so then, you know, I still have a pack of raw wires here that I'm not sure if I'm using yet or not. Of course I have uh, for my exhaust. This is my power steering, which has a bunch of raw ends, which I don't know where it's going. And then my air conditioning system has tons of raw wires and a crazy ass diagram of stuff randomly going all, all over the place. So um, it's not a lot of wires, it's just where they're tapping to is a lot of stuff and random different places in the car. So it's actually spread out all over the place. So I'm kind of surprised this doesn't look like enough wire to do any of that. But in any case, uh, you could hear it in my voice. It's just like, I don't want to say, I guess it is overwhelming. It's not really overwhelming, but it's just, it's disheartening that I have to do this. <laughs> you know, if, if I could just, you know, order online that I'm going to do this with this and this and this, and then they give me one manual with the proper wire harness that does it all, then that's awesome. But splicing all this stuff together, that's going to suck. And I kind of want to do it in stages, but you do it in stages and then you're kind of you're kind of putting yourself back and into a corner. I especially kind of want to do that for the air conditioning system, kind of get the car up and running and then wire all this stuff in afterwards. But I think there's certain wires that I really need to tap in now and figure out where this is supposed to be mounted first and then uh, kind of go from there. You know, even if it's not up and running and there's no free on and all that kind of stuff, but at least get it wired and some of the stuff mounted in place so it's ready for that afterwards. And that way I'm only making, you know, one splice into the wire instead of splicing somewhere and then going, oh man, I got to splice this in too and I don't have any space anymore because I took the last part of the wire harness that I could use to tap into or, you know, I'm just creating scenarios for myself, but that's the kind of stuff I think about all the time. So in any case, it's, it's looking a little hairy, but, uh, I got somewhere. You know, that's the biggest thing is I actually got somewhere. This has been looking like a cluster for, uh, you know, over a week now. And I finally took a little time off of work early to just come home and mess around with this and get somewhere with it. And so I kind of feel like I did that today. And that's, uh, that's good in my book. So not super excited, but happy that we uh, moved forward. So.